Welcome back to Definitive Edition. Today, Josh is going to be doing some uh, solo play of a uh, PS2 launch title, Evergrace. All right, guys. Uh, this game, uh, it, it was a launch title. Uh, we're having some fucking quality issues already. Um, it's It was a really neat game because no one knew what to expect for the PS2 and what it could do. Hold on one second. I'm going to fuck with something. Ooh, yeah, getting some, uh... Oh, yeah. Oh, that's the stuff. Okay. Yeah, that'd be better. There we go. I think it's good. It's stable, at least. Yeah. Alright, cool. Now, the first thing you'll notice, fucking music in this game is awesome as shit. I love it. And, uh, a long-ass time ago, I had this game. Like, back when PS2 first fucking came out. And then, all of a sudden, it was like... We couldn't fucking find it. And then about, I don't know, two, three years ago, I found it on Amazon for like 10 bucks. I was like, oh, fuck yeah. Because I couldn't remember the name of the game, and I saw it, I was like, oh my god, this is that game. So, you have two people you can be. You got Charlene, spelt in the most asinine way possible, and Darius. I'm going to be fucking Darius. because no, That I'm is a... definitely Sherline. Sherline? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that's an M. But yeah, I'm going to yeah, be yeah. Darius because I have a hard dick. And, uh... <laughs> so, like, this is one of the games that, uh... Utilized like pressure sensitive buttons like based on how hard you push the square button. What the fuck? I've never seen any PS2 game use that at all. I didn't even know it could register pressure yeah. sensitivity. Yeah, um, a very underused thing in... Yeah, I've never seen it used on yeah. PS2. Ever. What the fuck? I think I've only ever seen it used in one other game. But uh, this game, it's kind of like an action RPG. It's got some voice acting. It's kind of terrible, but uh, I'm gonna let this cutscene play while I talk over it. But uh, it's it's I, I really was hoping they would uh make a second one. Yeah. Cause like I thought they did. Uh, Evergrace too. I feel like it was it was like they were gonna make it, but then like funding got cut or something. Cause I saw a, I saw a screenshot for Evergrace too. Long ass time. Ever, ago. See, I, I've heard of Evergrace, but I thought Evergrace too was a thing too, but maybe not. Maybe you're thinking of EverQuest. Uh, yeah, you're probably right. The Honestly. the weird like MMO before. Wow. Finally, I found the enemy. Oh, it's uh, Evergrace Two is a Japanese title called Forever Kingdom. Really? Yeah, it's it's a Forever Kingdom known as in Japan as Evergrace Two. I might want to get that. Because, I mean, yeah, this game Japanese. This game leaves a thousand... Oh, there's probably a fan translation somewhere. But, uh, this game has, like, a thousand questions. Like, every single thing that you see is a question in this game. Like, Toledo. That sounds like fucking Spain. Isn't that Spain? No, it nope. sounds like... It's a small village in the Bologna Forest. Sounds like Now, Toledo, the first thing you're going like... to notice, the graphics in this game look like ass. <laughs> it is a launch title for PS2. It is a... So it's basically PS1. It's, it's PS1 with, like, slightly better... Like engine, but look at my spiky ass hair. Are you okay? I thought you were dead. Did you have an accident? Why are we laying on the ground like that? That voice acting is fucking. I don't know. <laughs> trash. It's, it's. They wanted to be good. <laughs> well, you got. Yeah, I mean, you have to forgive it. It is 15 years old now, so. I'm human, just like you. I don't know. Last time I checked, humans didn't look like fucking dragonfly dingly dangles. That looks my like the. Uh, that looks like a Nuva ring. Chrysalis. Uh, one of those. Uh, Entered and in, in, entered, entered. You very fucking contraceptive things. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. I, I do, but I don't know what they're called. I can't remember. Is that IUD? Yeah, know. that. What yeah. an intrauterine yeah. device. Believe me, I don't wish to look like this. I was transformed by my will against the demon. So look, there's already like a thousand uh, questions. Sorry for the shakiness. That, that, that I don't shaky know. screen is dope. I don't know if that's like. The, it might be the game. I don't remember. <laughs> demon? You expect me to believe that? Monsters it's it's probably just you don't our know. fucking. You must be from the outside, right? Look, there's already a sword in the background. I'm already interested in this game. It's got so much going for it. Outside, outside of what? Outside of here. Blah blah blah. blah. Bob, Have you ever heard good. of the Rubain Empire? What about it? You're in it right now. I don't believe in such fairy tales. I'm serious. Look, dude, there's monsters everywhere. Where am I? I just don't get it. Yeah, blah blah blah. You need to be careful. So, so here we are. Um, there we go. So I got my fucking fists on. Bah. Yeah, based on how hard you hit the square is how much power you use in your attack. What the fuck? It's awesome as shit, if you ask me. But, uh... I'm trying to remember how the fucking controls of this game, I don't remember. Why, right. why is attack square? That's odd. Draw, draw. 
Well, X is interact, I guess. No. Yeah. I, I guess All right, so. Sword of the Dead. Oh, good thing I'm. Oh this yeah, great Sword camera. of the Dead, huh? <laughs> I took it's like the sword. The of the fucking living. <laughs> I'm so relieved. So yeah, about the monsters. Yeah, blah 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 blah. Yeah, Palmyra armaments. It's not a regular sword. It's a different. I knew. I love it. And that's what we call bad voice acting. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I like that better than whatever this fucking robot dragonfly fucking... I don't even know, dude. Birth control thing. So is. I need a magician's help to make my shit strong, basically. That's all she's saying right now. So now you gotta go back to your inventory, because it's all action RPG. You got equipment. Look at all these stats, dude. Holy, Holy fuck. shit. <laughs> I did not know you were playing a fucking game of D&D. &D. <laughs> so, so obviously this is better. Fucking Neverwinter Nights. My right attack now. goes from uh, 36 to uh, 115. Yeah, yeah, Sounds yeah. good to me. Uh-huh. Now look at my pose. I look like I got like a dagger. Yeah, it's, it's like not, a, not even a sword. It's like a, well, like uh, it's like, a, like a long pencil. It's funny thing because like when you look at swords in history, like what we call swords were like gig like what we want swords to be are gigantic. Like old swords used to be real fucking tiny. God, go away. Because you gotta swing them fast. Yeah. All right. So you, when you run, you lose power. Uh, here's a little fucking cabbage armadillo. Watch this. He's like, eh, I'm gonna get you. Yeah. Cabbage, right, you go. cabbage Bam! armadillo. Fuck him up. Yeah. I go, mm -hmm. Is that the actual name of this creature? I don't, I don't know. Oh, like it's something ca weird. Cabbage armadillo. Oh, I just fucking... That's flying ding, cabbage armadillo. Dingle dangle fucking shooting Arabic at me. Dingle dangle. Oh, what in the fuck? <clears throat> oh, fuck, I missed. God damn it. Get dead, you piece of shit. So yeah, if you don't have enough power... If you've ever played Secret of Mana, it's a lot like that system. Uh, if you don't have enough power, your attacks will do, like, nothing. So it's a very good balance of, like, rapid swinging and dodging and running and stuff. Uh, let's see if I remember how yeah, to get not, places. Yeah, not running yourself to death, apparently. Yeah, <laughs> just fall over dead. <clears throat> now you can stay at zero. It just takes a little bit to get it back up. No. Enemies will just keep spawning, by the way. They'll just, like, spawn in walls. I'm going to casually walk to the side and then go, boop. And go, boop. <laughs> but yeah, I love it. Like, like, no, like you said, no other freaking game uses, uh, like... Pressure sensitive yeah, controls. That's a really the PS2 thing. had it, and uh, I don't, I don't think it was one of their selling points. But it was like one of those things. They're like, we can make this work because you have to like jam that fucking square in to get to get the power to go. All <laughs> Breaking the way. controller since 2000. I like that. Oh, you're almost dead. Get dead, bitch. <laughs> See, I never played a whole lot of PS2. Like I just, I had one, but I, my brother played a whole lot, and I skipped over it. Just went straight to Xbox. Really. Oh, that skybox. <laughs> oh yeah. My hair is so spiky. I uh, <laughs> I jumped straight into a game that we're gonna play on this show eventually. What's that? Painkiller. Oh, dude. Pain Probably the single best fucking Xbox One game ever made. Except for maybe <sighs> Halo. And mix it for you. Maybe Halo. Oh, yeah, uh, dude. Whatever. All right, all right. Let's get this on the road. So this is old dude right here. Right? Uh, he's, he's like, this, like, he's turtle, like turtle creature. Yeah, oh, you yes, bother man. me. We're all going to die. And he said, yeah, Castle Rubain. Blah, blah, blah. Interesting question. Yep, yep. I need to go. So th that old dude's bummed out because everybody's going to die, apparently. You don't know why. Yeah. You got teleported to this weird mystical land. Who the fuck cares? So you... <laughs> It's super obvious, but you gotta go find that guy's dog, right? I mean, that's that's the obvious, right? <laughs> He's bummed out because his dog's gone. Um, I got you don't need any story. You don't need any story here. You just fucking start the oh, game. Dude, look at that fucking pinwheel thing, man. I'll tell you, oh like, as you're going. God. Boom. In the dude, game. Dude, dude, dude. Wait till you see the shop owner. He's weird as fuck. Oh, dude, dude. So many memories as I'm running up this. I gotta... Scout out the land. Mm. <laughs> oh, yeah. Very interesting Sweet. scape of land. Dude, look at these fucking weird-ass rocks. These fucking pillars. Hit them. Ow. Ow. What the, Ow. What the fuck? I don't know if you see that W70. That's like your weapon's durability. It just kind of goes down at random. The more you use it, obviously. But it's like... It also just kind of arbitrarily goes down. Hold on. I think I missed a thing. I don't remember. Uh. Oh, now it's at 69. Am I right, guys? Yeah, 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 that's what I'm talking about. That's the good stuff. That's the good number. I don't know about all that. That's the good number. Oh, but, uh, <laughs> dude, like, I'm trying to think if there's any other game at all that ever uses the pressure sensitive. I can't think of For one. anything. Oh, <laughs> Whoa, check out them splash graphics. <laughs> I've seen Splash a, graphics. I've seen a lot and played a handful of uh, PS2 games. Never knew ah, about it until you yeah. just told me. So I there's a thing really cool. under there. 
How do you get it? I don't remember. You can't, you can't, I really you can't don't crouch? remember. Where the fuck? There's, the dog was supposed to be up here, I thought. You can, like, do that number, but... The dog was supposed to be up here, I thought. Oh, let me... Let me run back this way. Oh, God. Backtracking already. I could have sworn the puppy was up here. Did you kill the dog, dude? I That's hope fucked not. up, man. Did you kill the He's guy supposed to, like, run around, and then you go down here, and you have to fight a thing. And then you get the... He, he goes in that burrow and gets you the armor, but... Uh, apparently not. Apparently the dog just doesn't exist, so fuck me. Alright, well next time on Definitive Edition, we will, uh, we'll try to find that dog. Hell yeah. And, uh, it'll be fun. Ooh, ooh, ow, 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 yeah.